Hello, I'm Gavin from FGDI. Today I'm going to give you an overview of our Embedded Video Engine, or EVE. I have a module here, which is the VM801 Plus module, which is a 5-inch capacitance screen. It's a standalone display, which is 5-point multi-touch, and it uses our Atmega 328 microcontroller. So it's a fully integrated display. The Atmega 328 microcontroller it's a 5 volt micro and it runs at 16 megahertz, typically using Arduino libraries. These are a free download, so it's a very useful tool. The FT801 communicates over SPI to the Atmega328. The module has a resolution of 480 by 272. The module has a backlight LED driver, audio speaker and power amplifier, FT232R chip. This allows USB to serial connection to program the Atmega, micro SD socket, and an included four gig SD card, preloaded with samples, images, and videos. Module also has a battery backed up real-time clock, two micro connectors to allow daughter card expansion. The module comes in two available bezels. You can see this one, we have black, or we have peril. We have a screen editor tool that is available on the FTDI website. First, we connect the module. As long as the computer is connected to the internet, the driver will install. You can see on the screen editor, I can create contents or bring in images. We can add widgets, all drag and drop and very easy to manipulate. We can change the text. Finally, we'll export to Arduino library. The IDE for the Arduino opens automatically. Check that the correct serial port is connected and the correct board is selected, which is the Atmega328. We now upload. And the program that we saw on the screen editor will now program. Via the R chip, you can see the transmit and receive LEDs flashing as the device has been programmed. And then we will see the program running with the exact same image that we had on the screen editor. The VM801 Plus board supports multiple I.O. daughter cards. I have two examples here. We have SPI to RS-232 or SPI to Ethernet. These connect directly to the micro connectors on the bottom, increasing the capability of the board to give an RS-232 bridge or an Ethernet bridge. The FT801 chip, which is used on this module, has multiple applications. For example, a home security system where this could be connected to a camera. We have now brought out EVE 2. This further expands the family to increased resolution. The resolution is now up to 800 by 600 pixels, which can be used on a 7-inch screen. We've increased memory. We've added quad SPI to give us four times the speed. And it's also up to 24-bit RGB. All the products that I've just been discussing are available on RS components website. Thank you.